yeah good day everyone this thing um in this video i'm going to show you how easily you can create your own http digital conversation file so just follow me as i show you now first of all you have to make sure you clear any existing uh conversation file on in your http digital now click on clear settings now you can see everything is being clear now click on this to create so use the host you want to use to to connect for example bblight users can use a um, web.blabberry.com well uh, social me can use a um, mobile facebook.com or twitter.com or facebook.com now after inputting the host address click on this and then click on generate payload now input your um, IP and port now if you have a fast IP just existing one just input the IP and um, for also those using BB light the normal IP 10.199.212.2 then port 8080 now I'm going to use this IP um, then my port 83 one to eight. Now we are connecting it with SSH um, server. You know, you have to create an account with them by going to fastssh.com, create an account, then just save it and input the details into this uh, this configuration. Now, assuming already you already create your own account, just press start. Now you see, take it to next next step. Now input your server IP that is for SSH. I'm using Jamming IP now the port is 443 then input your username um, then input your password now press save you can see now let's test if the settings is okay that is if it's going to to connect and for those using on rooted phone can use VPN service while well, those using rooted phone can use them um, IP tables uh, root now click on start then go to log yeah wait for the HTTP you can see forward successful then connected you can see connected here now press now let's stop and amplify now so stop your connect the connecting uh, click on this or use this you can see export configuration now name your file maybe like um, social me then for security you can lock and can leave it unlocked if you are using personally you can lock hey you can unlock if you want to use on you know upload it on various sites you can lock the configuration file just make sure you just tick the one that will be preferable now you know ssh account have validity of three to uh, seven days so just make sure you don't lock the SSH um, host and post then the um, username and password in case you may want to use another server location so just leave it open then if you have uh, many messages to pass through to pass through to people like by So just press export after everything now wait for the file to successfully export you can see successfully now test the configuration file before sharing now we have already tested the configuration file now let's try to import the file back now to know if it's working now import 
communication file now go to where the file is being saved it's going to be saved to under HTTP ejector that is under your external or internal memory card now social me um, let the stop to import successful so now you can see it's see what we just created now so to start just click on start then go to log to see if it's going to connect you can see connected at the top then you can see that is i'm using the vpn service now you can see the uh, vpn key now so that's all about creating your own um, personal configuration file so thanks for following me um thanks so much see you later